Hello everybody and welcome back to another video. My name is Zach, otherwise known as Poppy Syntax, and today is the 1st of December, which means it's time for Vlogmas. <laughs> um, I'm actually recording today. This is my buddy for the next 24, 25 days. Maybe I should name it. <laughs> um, so the sun is just rising, the birds are already chirping, and Chantel has uploaded a vlog. So I thought I would get a sneaky little react in before I have to head off to work. So with all of that being said, <laughs> let's get into the video. Today we're at 1.5 times speed because... Mostly because I'm going to be late if I don't. Because <laughs> this is 40 minutes. Park Omega. we're gonna put it but we have to take a ferry we have to take an actual ferry uh -huh. to get to park omega which i never had to do before i guess we took a different way before okay this is funny is it <laughs> good timing though we got here just as the ferry came in yeah okay. we do need to pay the ferry though do we ten dollars okay i think i have a 10 in my well a 20 in my wallet oh my gosh i've never done this i'm scared no it is chill down why the fear? <laughs> just why? <laughs> why a lot? Do I just park anywhere? Okay. Just right here? I guess so. Oh my god, it's moving! Mm -hmm. It's not actually moving yet. Yes, it is. <laughs> sure is like, that's nice, dear. <laughs> okay. Yeah. So you were to get the seasick? Yeah. And it's very smooth. Yeah, that's true. Okay, as if we It's beautiful. Yeah. I mean <laughs> I'll show off my my hometown today, but but this is I mean it's stunning. Stunning. This is like so cool, isn't it? It is pretty cool. That's pretty cool. It adds to the cool, experience. Cool, cool. So we just have to cross the bay and then come back, I guess. How hope they're open, imagine we'd be stranded. It'd be the other way. Yeah, way, sure. yeah, we'd have to go a longer way. So I didn't know this was a thing. Apparently it's a shortcut. I guess. Ten dollars. Good thing I had a twenty. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I didn't know we had a Sorry, I only have debit. And then they just push your boat right off or push your car right off the boat. <laughs> Here comes another ferry, I think. Yep. Pretty neat, huh? Very sorry. Yep, yeah. it's neat. I think this probably takes you right over to Quebec. I would assume so. Oh uh, yeah, so this is um this is it's labeled day trip with Pete's cute animals, cheeseburgers, and poutine. So it's a mukbang. Um you can't sneak it past me, Miss Chantel. Um but was this, so this was during her, the sequence is so bizarre because she went for smoke meat in Quebec and this is the same day, probably later in the afternoon would be my assumption. Um, but then she had at home stuff earlier this week as well. I don't, I don't know. I don't know. Timelines, man, not my strong suit. Have a nice day. Strong point. Not my strength. Let's start saying that. Okay, guys. Catch I just wanted to show you that. See you later. Hey guys, okay. hey, how are you? How are you? We wanted to do this as a live stream. I catch myself oh, saying. Sorry. We wanted to do this video as a live stream, but we don't get any reception around here. We're at Park Omega oh. in Montebello, Quebec. Pressed about that. <laughs> yeah, we really don't get any reception at all. Therefore, we have to do a video for you guys. So I apologize. Uh -huh. we'll do a live stream another time, maybe during the week or whatever. But for now, we're just going to drive around and see the animals. Park Omega is a huge conservation park, and um, there's a ton of. I've never heard of it, so I'm looking at mostly up. native animals. There's some black bears, um, deer, buffalo, stuff like that. So. Without further ado, let's get to, let's get to. Right. We have this radio station on. Oh, they have accommodation. For That's cool. Park Omega. So. Are they going to stay overnight? I'm guessing. Just came here to go to the bathroom. You can buy things here. I think you can buy carrots here as well to feed the animals. We brought our own. <laughs> oh, you bought your own carrots. Carrot. <laughs> I have an issue with this. <laughs> I have an issue with this. Like, it's it's not really that big of a deal, but like purchasing things like souvenirs and gifts and animal feed from the actual 
business that is in the business of conservation goes towards assisting animal conservation. You bringing your own carrots is just like it. It just feels like you're you're not stealing from a charity, but you're just like you're not supporting the. I mean, you're feeding the animals, but you're not supporting the conservation effort that's gone into having the animals here in the first place. I don't know. It's a bit of <laughs> roundabout logic for me, but it just feels wrong. Big ass carrots, huh? Look at the size of this carrot. That's a big carrot. Franken carrot. Like bringing your <laughs> own popcorn to the, the cinema, myself, but like. Mapping the animals are the losers, not the oh, like not the cinema owners. Oh, piggies! Who wants a carrot? If this is just filled with cute it's animals, it's already. fine. I'm just gonna <laughs> oh my guffaw oh, over the them. Pigs. Hello. What kind of pig is it? They have food. Uh, um, like it's a look at the baby pig. Just, it just says "boy." I'm it's on the so website. <laughs> Like They're not a particular type of pig, it's just a boar. Oh, I can feed this one a carrot. Hey. Or not. Whoa, hey, like, <laughs> I know this is sped up, but that kind of came across a bit rude. And I get it, they're animals. Like, they, they can sense aggression, <laughs> but that was just a bit like, who bangs on a car to get an animal's attention? Uh, I don't, I don't know how I feel about this. Oh, okay. Hi. Lana, if you want another carrot. I'm hungry for carrots. You want some carrots? Come here. So pretty. Oh, it's so pretty. <laughs> it's going around. Oh. <laughs> oh, it's... <laughs> Hi. It dropped the carrot on the car. Oh, pig crossing. <laughs> the sun goes down here at 423, I think I looked on Google. Oh my goodness, there's a lot of them. Well, I looked on this and the park closes okay. at five, so. The sun is uh, getting the glare on the. Hi, oh my gosh, look at this little one. There it is. It's okay. Wasn't too big for this, buddy. Is this a white tailed deer this or a fallow mountains. deer? Or a red deer? I don't know. I'm learning about nature. So really have Thanks, Chantel. <laughs> Maybe break them in half because we're no, that one's bad. not a fallow deer. It wants a smaller carrot, see? Red deer? I can't see the tail. I don't think it's a white tail deer. Maybe it is. Are you keeping your visor down so they don't bother you? No, it's because the oh, right, it's because the sun was in my way the other. <laughs> Say hi. Hi. I think it's a red. Enjoying your carrot? It's got no a cool comment. earring. There's a big one. Mm -hmm. These are little baby ones. Hi. Maybe they. I don't think they're white. They're not white tails, right? Because they've actually got white tails. It's okay. I think this is a red deer because they're teeny. There you go. <laughs> oh, how, 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 how. <laughs> it is a mukbang. Hi, <laughs> look. Hold on a sec. Here, you give them this guy. Oh, yeah, still not a fan of BYO carrots. <laughs> it's just me. It's just me. I'm sure the business doesn't mind. Isn't it cute? Mm -hmm. I can't see. Hold on a minute, you big piggy. There's a thumb in the way. Oh, you took the whole carrot. Oh, look at that one looking. Okay. <laughs> oh, hi. Do you want to give him something? Yeah, that one's I'm being very patient. Hi. Very tight shot in this All car. Right. Move out of the way. Sorry, buddy. Move it. Cat We're moving, buddy. <laughs> We're moving, guys. Fine. <laughs> guys. Oh, he smells this one. Here you go. Look, it's too, it's too big for Guy. it. Guy. Lady, back off, lady. Oh. Here's the... Just let him, let him be. You're in their space, Pete. It's like, come on. Just... Be nice to the animals. Also, this now has me thinking about how sad the animals must be in zoos that aren't open. Or, well, maybe not in zoos that aren't open. Maybe the animals are actually okay with not being, like, gawked at all the time. But, if they're being fed like this, I mean, they seem pretty happy. This tiny little one just trying to eat. Oh, Plus, it's like a nature nice. reserve, right? You so... Give something? Just break a piece. Don't give them that big. Oh, is this a red deer? Oh, oh my god. The oh, little the horns. Hey? Mm -hmm. You're adorable. Maybe it's just a baby. I don't know. Right. I don't know animals. 
Hopefully, this is fun. hopefully he eats when he drops. This is fun. That one had. This is fun. Thank you. We're not allowed the rest to, uh, I think are the rest. I think are uh, are girls. They're ladies. We're not allowed to uh, get out of our vehicles. Hello. Good. <laughs> I wouldn't want to. Yeah, I got, you got one on your side too. Hi. You're so cute. Yes, you are. Hi. Aren't they beautiful animals though? They're so beautiful. Hey. Yep. You have a nice boy beside you. All right. Some for you and some for you. Did you <laughs> Just to make it clear to him that he's not getting food from us. Oh, that's me. Shut the window on him. <laughs> okay. My bye guess bye. is that they don't want them getting aggressive. Bye bye. Look. Bye bye. <laughs> you see how cute your head's in the window. Mm -hmm. Hi. Bye bye. <laughs> bye. Oh, you had enough. Wait for the next that one. That one was being very manipulative. Look at. Good boy. Bye, boy. <laughs> bye, handsome boy. <laughs> There's more coming up here. I'm gonna run out of carrots. I'm gonna cut them in half. What did you do? Here's one for you, little one. <laughs> Aren't you looking like a fine little lady? Hey, <laughs> if you are. Would you like a carrot? They're probably like, oh, more carrots. You like them? Are they good? Hey. We could give you some rotten crab apples. <laughs> I always thought of those crab apples under my wig in the back. I didn't see them. Wait, she still has the apples in the car from Halloween, or from October? <laughs> Gagged or something. Huh. Mm. <laughs> oh, no. It's going down. Right in my face. Uh. Right in our faces. It's a really nice conservation area. Yep. Okay. It's very pretty. Yep. And why is there a bench here? We're not allowed to get out, I don't think. I don't think there's actually a bench. Um, it looks more like a feeding trough. Oh, okay. I did do some reading, and you, I don't think in Corona times you can do this, but there are like hiking trails. Um, and like out, outdoor walking spaces and accommodation here. So may, maybe, so or maybe it's just a. Sun. That's a nice shot there. Beautiful sky. Look at the little. Just uh, like a rest zone. Little... Oh, cool. Look at... I think little animals hide out in here, probably. Probably. Yeah. That's cute. Maybe beavers. <laughs> I did. If this looks familiar. I did. If this looks familiar, guys, I did come here before with a uh, BB. Wow. It's really beautiful. Quebec is a very beautiful province. That's why they call it La Belle Province. Might be a bit shaky on these That nose. and the... Uh, that and the French always like to pretend they're better than everywhere else. <laughs> Don't pretend it's not true. Please! <laughs> Don't get offended at me, guys. You know what? Every Quebec, every Quebecois person uh, watching your video is like, <laughs> No, no! It's absolutely true. <laughs> we do think we're better. Well, maybe they are. Maybe they are. <laughs> I don't know the inner workings of the pretend... Uh, potential... <laughs> provincial... Um... Pretentiousness. There we go. I, I got there in the end. Uh, but sure, go off. <laughs> Whatever. I did learn something interesting um, about Quebec in that I was confused as to why everything that I was looking at was defaulting to French. And then it made sense um, because there was a literal charter um, discussing like the prominence of the French language over the English language in the... Um, in the province, so like that makes sense. I think maybe maybe they're overfed. I don't know. Are these pigs again? Piggies. Oh, look at the little baby <laughs> running away. You see them? Yeah. Well, it reminds me of Pumba or Timon and Pumba. Oh, we know it. Oh, we know it. Oh, we... Look at the family running. You it's even better, sped up. <laughs> Means no worries for the rest of your days. Aww. <laughs> look at them. Are they cute? Yeah. Little legs. <laughs> you know, you're running the same way we're we're driving, so you're just gonna keep ahead of us. And now the deer are running. Oh, I don't want to scare them. I think they were scared off by the pigs. It seems like these animals are very used to, to cars, so oh, what, cool I'm sure it's oh, fine. An apple. Look at him touching the apple. You see him? No. Oh, hi, hi, sweetheart. Feeding more deer. Aww. It looks like Bambi. This one. They all kind of look like oh, Bambi. <laughs> you see, it just snubbed me. Is this a white hey. tail? They the white. Well, that one's just tiny. Can we see? Hi, Bambi. Hi, Bambi. That That's Bambi's mom. <laughs> <laughs> it's too big for its mouth. Aww, I can't eat it. Need some need some Amberlynn sized baby carrots. Can't eat it, see? <laughs> Sorry. It'll manage. It'll figure it out. Here comes another one to the rescue. If you can't eat it, I will. Yeah, these are white tailed deer. I knew I wasn't mad. 
Ooh. Is it do I need it? Your precious it's little really boy. <laughs> They're way too big. <laughs> Poor little deer, eh? She's happily trying her best, though. I don't want them to choke. <laughs> See? I wonder if it's gonna eat it. That's why you touch it from the business, maybe talk to like okay? a, the tour operator. There you go. <laughs> you can do it. Smashing it up in its mouth. There we go. <laughs> what a cute little creature. Mm -hmm. huh? You're such a cute little creature. <laughs> they have to be their prey. Yep. Bye bye. You had a mouthful there, anyways. All right. <clears throat> So this park has wolves as well, which is interesting. Yeah, they're probably overfed in a way. I mean, they'll probably eat And by park, like, it's in nature reserve, so they've got all sorts. Wolves, foxes, coyotes, deer. That's our coloring. It's it's a goth. Goth deer, too. It's too cool. It's not conforming to the carrots, man. There's something called a cinnamon bear. doesn't eat orange carrots, right? Oh, that should be my nickname. Cinnamon bear. Purple carrots, maybe. It's a beautiful day, guys. Um, it's just such a nice day. It's almost like we have the whole park to ourselves. Oh, right wait, now. that was a goat okay. before, not a deer, wasn't yeah, it? I'm an idiot. Well, they've got gooses and ducks. <laughs> All sorts. It's a problem. <laughs> they do have beavers. Oh, I think we're going to be entering the buffalo territory. The prairies. Yeah, we gotta be careful of the buffalo. The okay. buffalo won't even come near us, as far as I'm... As, as much as I remember, the buffalo don't come near you. Yeah. yeah. I'm glad I sped this up, guys. I don't think they're out right now. <laughs> like... <laughs> Are those birds? Yep. This almost feels too real, too raw, Was you know? Might be. Oh, they're turkeys. I think they're uh, wild turkeys. <laughs> more deer. And a gobbler. <laughs> wild turkey. Gobble, gobble. You wanna feed him a carrot? <laughs> the turkey? Yeah. This one probably wants a carrot from you. Move it. There's a tree Seeds, in the right? Move it. Move Seeds for birds. Hi, sweetheart. Hi. Feed the birds. Yeah, Top and survive. Name that. I I technically musical. <laughs> Either way, they're making me hungry. <laughs> they're nice. They're pretty. I don't think they're turkeys. I think they are. Anyone know? Yep. Uh, it looks like they're wild turkeys. They look very similar to our bush turkeys, which hopefully I'll get one on camera, but if I don't look it up, they're hilarious. <laughs> Literally just called a bush turkey or scrub turkey. <clears throat> Aww. They all want carrots now? <laughs> just a, and there's just a tiny little chunk of a carrot, so I just wanted to get it out the window, basically. <laughs> Nature. It's like a bear or something. Look at it. It's so pretty. Oh, what's that? Oh, that's a bison. Aw. We can't see the bison. Lonely guy. We might need to throw a carrot just to get it out of the way. Excuse me. There's a bison. It's a baby bison. Hi. And it's pretty much directly in our path. Yeah. Hi. That's all right. Just wait for him to move. Excuse me. Excuse me. Oh my god. I'm going to oh. get one. It's a baby one. It doesn't have horns yet, so. Well, we got it. He has little guys. Hello. Where's Hi. mom? I think mom's in this the background. This is a bison, right? You yeah, sure? I think so. Hi. Pretty sure. Isn't it sweet? Mm -hmm. It's a baby bison. They get a lot bigger than this. Oh, yeah. Well, I got up like a ton. A micro ton. Really? Wow. Hi. As opposed to, we're breaking the law. Hi. Are you meant to feed the bison? I don't know. I had a bison head right beside me. Is it a good me. idea to do this? <laughs> Okay, we gotta go. Deer seem okay, but bison, like, there's got to be a mom out there being like, where's Billy? <laughs> See, <his tongue>? Billy, <laughs> why are you standing on the road again? Get yeah, away from that car. <laughs> nice. Got that tongue action on camera. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. You look lonely walking. <laughs> wow. Okay, let me get the shots here. Oh, animals are so precious. <laughs> look how beautiful this area is. The sun's going down, so it's... It's a really nice place for the animals. It's not, it's not little cages and, you know, they get to roam free, yeah. eat a healthy vegetarian diet of carrots. 
apples. Yeah. Grass. Yeah. I mean, the only negative I see to this is the human interaction, but Look like, at the feet of buffalo. They're the reason that. Bison, bison. I mean, humans are the reason why animals. I have are no idea if there's actually a difference between bison and buffalo. Doing this anyway. I'm not sure. That's a whole conversation. <laughs> the same critter. Yes, critter. The little feet pattern. It's so pretty. You see that? Yeah, this is God, could you imagine if it was snowing? Oh. Big. Oh. Look at them. I'll just keep our distance from these ones. Yep. See here. Whoa. Hey. <laughs> He's coming to get you. Hey, buddy. Oh. Uh. <laughs> How cool. Hey there. Hi. <laughs> I'm gonna scare you. <laughs> you did good. You did good. You did well. Listen. I wasn't too scared because I had my window. Just look at the window now, though. Ugh. Oh, you can turn in here and. Uh, yeah, so these are their cabins some and stuff. stuff. Get some food, maybe? Or, or not. Or like, not. They have a food court out here? <laughs> yeah, because it looks like there's a bunch of kids around there. Yeah, we, we so. want to stay away from the kids. Avoid the kids and just see the animals? Yeah. <laughs> you sound so hard. My birds are chirping. Oh, he's chasing the apple. He keeps rolling away from him. <laughs> Hello. What a pretty boy. They're shedding for the, uh, their coat is shedding or something, eh? I have no idea. Oh, he's pretty. Eh? I don't know how deers work. He's a handsome it, man. A I hope it's man. not mange. Oh. I'm sure it's na terrible. natural. <laughs> I see that one. Hello. But they would be going into winter, so the coat would be That's coming in. Mm -hmm. That's a pretty one. Look, they look heavy on his head. It looks like, um, when the Grinch put those big antlers on Max's little head. <laughs> I'll speak over Chantel because I want her to <laughs> speed along. <laughs> Ooh, wolf. Here, wolfy, wolfy, wolfy. What type of wolf? <laughs> Is it a gray wolf? I, I would say that maybe an arctic wolf. I think arctic wolves are white. Yeah, zoom on it. yeah they're super white. So that's a gray boy, yeah, maybe, I think. Hello. That's an arctic wolf. Wow. <gasps> oh, okay. This is how it works. I'm like, how did they, <laughs> no carrots. <laughs> I was wondering how, how they kept Predator away from prey, but oh, turns out chicken wire is the answer. Hi. 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 Hi, you're so pretty. <laughs> you guys are so pretty. Look at them. Oh my goodness. Did you bring a steak to throw in? No. <laughs> oh, they're like. They're tan. <laughs> That's very cool. Piece of carrot fell. Hi. Did we pause this? <laughs> I don't know what's gonna fall. I don't know. I'd have to shoot it really well, honestly. It says not to feed them carrots either. Did you want that little... Oh, he looks... You're contemplating seven. throwing a carrot at this poor dog. He's so gorgeous. I love them. Yes, that. he says no carrots, so... Better off not feeding him carrots. Yeah, we saw a bunch of wolves. Yeah. The wolves obviously like to put on a show. Yeah. They have the cutest little faces. The foxes weren't really into it today, but the wolves, they were, like, yo. Showing off. They're like, yo. Foxes are probably, like, hiding underground at this point. Chugga, chugga, chugga. It's exhausting just driving up it. <laughs> Rocky Mountain goats here, guys. Oh, okay. No, we found the goats. Hanging out on the Rocky Mountain. I don't know what that that <laughs> other half breed was before. <gasps> rocky Mountain. I mean, really, aren't most mountains pretty rocky? <laughs> <laughs> pretty much. It's here. Danger. Black bears. Oh, are we oh, gonna see a bear? Cool. Like Please see a cinnamon bear. <laughs> and black bears. Yep. Would bears? There's a bear den, I think, in would there. bears be like mid hibernation now, oh. though? I don't like honestly <laughs> our koalas <Yeah>. don't hibernate <laughs> I'm not familiar with the uh, Hello? the life cycle of bears sleep well the bears probably hibernate I think so I would think so yes I was just talking about did your mom ever do this my mom used to take my toes and go this little piggy went to the market this little piggy stayed home this little piggy had roast beef this little piggy had none and this little piggy went mee, 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 all the way home with the pinky toe and that yep. made me laugh so hard do you never probably. do that I mean, I've heard, um, I assume that, <laughs> I assume that I heard it from my mom doing it to me. Like, would be like, I think it's a well-known element of, I have very few uh, memories of my early childhood, so. Yeah. Yeah, early childhood, thank you, oh, Pete. That's too bad, I have a lot of memories from there. Well, I don't think we're going to see any bears. I think the bears are hibernating, guys. Usually, they end the trail with the black bears, but, um, there doesn't seem to be any. Yeah, it's cold. No, the bears. The bears. Mm -hmm. Saturday Night Live reference. <laughs> She knows because I told her that to the was. No! It's from back when Chris Farley was on. They had a recurring sketch of uh, Bears superfans. Uh, like a show hosted by four, three or four uh, Chicago Bears superfans. Yeah. 
and uh, yeah, they're all just like a bunch of fat guys from Chicago, and uh, <laughs> you know, they like, da bears. Oh. <laughs> I see something walking over there. Please show me. <laughs> we have a few carrots left we have to get rid of here. So, hi. Hi. Would you like something to eat? Hi. It's so pretty. Mm hmm. Matilda, come in and get it. Come in and get it. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Hi. I think I know what else is holding up traffic. Me? No. What's that? One's walking in the middle of the road. Oh, yeah. <laughs> we don't have any more carrots. Yeah. I mean, so I now got, we're getting oh, to the end of the video. I've got one and a half left. Um, but in my mind, I keep going, but Zach, she's, she's traveling in the middle of a pandemic. <laughs> the cute animals deter from that, right? She's not interacting with, with people and she's not screaming about essentialness and mukbanging. So there is still a cheeseburgers and poutine element to this that we will see. Um, do I think she should be traveling across provincial lines? No, but we've already had that discussion. And at least this video has cute animals to, to distract me. So... <laughs> Again, it's all my opinion. I don't <laughs> care about the health advice. <laughs> Big guy's head just popped out of nowhere. <laughs> it was so funny. He <laughs> just seen his big head coming in. Uh huh. Hi. <laughs> Here. Oh, the way. oh, sorry. There's a cat and carrots like littering the background. <laughs> oh, look, look at the pigs. Mm -hmm. They sound funny. <laughs> I'm gonna go around. Re. <laughs> Here we are on our way. Bye bye, Park Omega. Oh, we're done. Until next time. That was cute. Essential? No. We decided we're gonna but go. Cute. We decided we're gonna go into the town of Montebello and get something to eat since we are hungry. Yeah, but I haven't had breakfast yet. <laughs> On account of I woke up at two. It's five p.m. <laughs> oh, Pete's works nights though, so. Quarter to five. Yeah, quarter to five in the evening. Time for breakfast. I actually got up at ten thirty today, and I feel great. I knew like when I get up in the day, I feel so much better, and I had a nice bowl of cereal with some blueberries. La di da, miss. I feel good, but I For those of you who get this far, <laughs> are blueberries the best berry? I think so. Get up at a reasonable <laughs> hour. <laughs> Look at me. <laughs> Montebello is a very small town. There might not even be any restaurants open. <laughs> oh, right, get the COVID too. Yeah, but. Yeah, it's almost five o'clock on a Sunday with COVID going on. In a small, small town. Uh, we've had that conversation. We don't need to have it here. This is very pretty, though. Small towns. <laughs> My southern hemisphere brain keeps going, Oh, look, Christmas trees everywhere! <laughs> no, they're pine trees, Zach. <laughs> Not just for Christmas. Oh, uh, dear. So early. The moon. Yeah. Right? yeah. It's very pretty. I appreciate it. Yeah, but it just means that you have to get up earlier when we want to do Look at this Christmas decorations out. Which I don't appreciate. Oh my god, really I could just do well this. Lit. Little town with a lot of little boutiques. With lights everywhere. Adorable. Yeah, Russia? Or Michael Center? I don't know. Bear in mind, I don't speak French. I don't read any French, so I will not know if something's a restaurant or not. Yes, I'm assuming a restaurant. Bar in my Oh, that park looks nice. There's Go for a walk through that park, kind of please. Street, which I don't know what that means. Um, Christmas. <laughs> you know, fast food. Cost because it's like fast food, right? Uh, oh, there's a restaurant there. That was a bistro. Bistro. Isn't this a cute little, quaint little town? Very. Like Motel Bello. I stayed there. It's very, very cute. 
for a minute. I that that sign said Pony Blockbuster? Is that a Blockbuster? Is that a, <laughs> it was a blue and yellow logo. What the restaurant? Great Maison. Yep. It does say Uber. Mm -hmm. So I got a poutine and a cheeseburger, and you got hamburger and fritz. That's a cute so, deli. Those fries are good. Let me know. Are they good? A dine in as Watch well. Yeah. Okay. Now you're traveling to a small, small provincial town. Ah. <sighs> Sitting in, in a deli. Oh man. See, this is like, and I, I work in tourism, so I get it. Um, but oh, I just, I kind of feel bad for these small places because you, you can't stop business. Like you can't, you, if you know, you have a, town of 600 people you can't be like oh sorry we're only doing takeaways like it would just undercut you so so much you're right yeah you're basically like stabbing yourself in the foot um but in tourist towns when you have people coming in and out all the time i don't know covid would just be like a, a concern for me yeah, yeah it's fine. <laughs> we've had this discussion already So that concludes our tour of Park Omega. Starting to get dark, so I hope you enjoyed just having a little bit of fun with us today. And we'll see you in the next video. Bye, guys. Bye. Bye. Okay, so I actually enjoyed that a lot more than I thought I would. I'm glad we were heavy on the animals and less heavy on the eating, to be completely honest. Um, I'm sad we didn't say a cinnamon bear, but we got to see wolves, so that was pretty cool. It was, it was fine. I mean, I, this is interesting because there is an amount of justification that goes along with this in terms of the travel. I think if, <laughs> from an audience perspective, I think if this vlog had been first followed by the smoke meat thing, it it may have softened the, um, the argument about traveling into hotspots, uh, particularly because it seems like Park Omega is like an outskirt space and there's like smaller towns near it. Um, so, I don't know, but I, I just know that that conversation is going to come up again after this. Uh, anyway, thank you so much. If you reached this point in the video, as always, I appreciate your comments, opinions, and eyeballs, and I will see you in the next video. And I'll see you in a vlog. <laughs> Bye.